So I was gonna make today's video about doing right by people, doing the right thing, right? The only way to go. And it's still about that, but <laughs> we're gonna throw a twist on it. So again, a little story, right? Um, real estate related, I guess any sales related, anything, right? I think this applies to. So we went and looked at this house and the lady, the house was just through an estate and went through probate, all that stuff. All that stuff was done, right? So they were clear to, you know, start marketing the house. So somehow or another, this lady came across this agent that is a uh, expert in uh, probate deals, <laughs> whatever that means. And, uh, either explained everything in a very confusing way or just did something weird because these people were just like really confused with the process and how it all works and all these, I don't know what they got told, but we went in there and we kind of chatted about it. They were telling us like what all they went through and like how it was a pain, like this whole big story. And I'm not gonna get into all that, but they just didn't know how the process worked, right? It seems it seems really daunting if you only buy like, most people buy like one or two houses, right? But when you do this stuff every day, it's like going to the store and buying some bananas, right? It's like really simple once you understand the process of how it works. So since I understand the process and how it works, you know, and the lady seemed like they wanted to know how to do it, I, took me, I don't know, two or three minutes and I explained to him, like, here's how it would work. If, you know, he buys the house, this is what would happen. This is what you would do. This is the papers you would fill out. This is how you would go about it. This is a, like a title company you would use. This is X, Y, and Z. Like, this is how everything kind of comes together and gets done. Probate or not probate, it doesn't matter. It's the same thing the way you would close it, right? As long as all the documents are in order and all their documents were. So, I think that a lot of people try to act like experts where they're not really experts. In a case like this, whoever that agent was, instead of actually explaining to the person how the process works, what would happen, how this, they just kind of labeled themselves an expert in this field and either didn't explain how the process worked or did a terrible job of explaining it. And I don't think that's right. Mostly when someone wants to know how the process works, right? And then once I explained the process to them, they're like, oh, no, oh, that's not too bad, right? So I think most people like an explanation because I think the first time you buy a house, it's really kind of confusing and daunting. And they're like, why do they want all these papers? And why are they looking at all these things? And why is my name spelled 10 different ways on this paper and all this different stuff, right? But you know, it's a really simple process once you go through it a few times and kind of understand it. And uh, honestly, this video is, I don't think people actually really understand the uh, the process of closing a house and how it works, right? And like what an agent's actual job is in this whole equation, right? So maybe I'll make a video about that, about what, how the process actually works from an agent standpoint, so you can understand that it's not that big of a deal, right? You know, everyone gets promised like, oh, if you go with me, I'll get you this much. Oh, really? Okay. <laughs> Good to know. <laughs> but anyway, so hope you have a great night and uh, watch out for those experts. <laughs>